relationship to her work. It's a lot about her making professional strides and trying to figure out how to keep. It was amazing. I mean, they're the sort of at the peak of what they do. They organize the most beautiful, creative photo shoots. You really feel like you're collaborating. And Annie Leibovitz is amazing, and Tani Goodman, who was the editor of that story. So I was kind of in a dream world. I was learning so much. And they named you the new queen of comedy. I know, that shocked me. I thought they'd just write, like, Lena is a person. But they, <laughs> they wrote that beautiful headline, so I'm very honored by the whole thing. And they put my dog in the spread, so what's not to like? And I watched the, the look and feel of Bond, and I'm delighted to be here. And we love your show, so what can we expect for Hannah this season? I think that I obviously don't like it when I see a woman's body that's been massively restructured. I understand that, you know, for as long as there's been photographs, people have been painting over little wrinkles and adding a nice glow, and it's been done. First it was done analog, now it's done digital. I don't have a macro existential thought about photoshopping, it's just a matter of taste. It felt a little bit slightly more comfortable than it did last year. We definitely, something Allison said the first year we were there was when they go to commercial break, everyone gets up and talks to each other. We were like, we don't know anybody. And this year we knew a few people, which we felt very cool. It's been so fun to completely fall apart on the show and in such a Marnie fashion that you kind of pretend you're not falling apart but you're totally falling apart. Everyone can see it but her. It's the most fun ever and um, for all the Marnies out there I will say because she's Marnie everything will be okay. It's just going to take longer than she wants it to because she won't admit that anything's wrong. So when she does that, when she admits that she, there's things that are messy, then finally she'll begin to mend, I think. When the director Tom Hemingway, uh, Richard Shepard asked me, Yes, because I have a 25-year-old daughter who obsessively watched the show and all the things that she's going through are the things that the characters in the show are going through. So it's, it's a real window into the world of young women who've left home, finished college or university and trying to make their way in the world. And the sexual politics, which is a far that have been eye-opening to say the least. So I loved it. Watching, does that mean there will be no nudity, no nude scenes? Um, I'm 57 years old. I think nude scenes are, you need a lot of body stockings, body doubles, and that would be inappropriate. Not people to kick their TV sets in. But thank you for that question. It, is, it was not unlike going to a new school and that everybody else knew each other and it worked together really well. And then you turn up. <laughs> Did you have a hoot on the show? Yeah, because they are, they they all really get on with each other, and so it felt like going to somebody's house where everybody likes each other, everybody gets on, and you're having a party. So except it's it's work, and Lena is a is a very un, unassuming boss because you'll be doing a scene with her, and she'll have a monitor right next to her watching what's going on, and yet directing and acting at the same time. And to pull that off and make it look so effortless um, is astonishing. I don't, I don't know how you do that. I actually, that was like a, <laughs> it was a weird afternoon because first of all, he asked a question that has just been asked so many times. And it truly wasn't even a question, it was a statement. And it was so, at the end of the day, just impolite. Because he was sort of saying to Lena, like, I don't like looking at you naked. And we never hear it in person. We, I've heard that feedback on blogs, in the press. I've never heard someone say it to our faces. And I think we all just had a really, you know, kind of instant, visceral response to him. And, um, but, you know. Anyone, I, it's not that I object to questions about nudity, it's that it really wasn't a question. Yeah, and the same kind of